Hey, welcome back, Rogue Techers. Um, so, when we last we left off, we had just finished completing another mission, but on the side, our pirate lance had attacked uh, Americ Convoy on this planet. So, in order to throw the scent off of us being the potential people who actually executed that mission, we're going to choose um, a mission today. We're going to go to Contracts. We've got a little bit of extra money, but we're going to need to generate a little bit more cash. Um, so we're going to choose this mission for the um, planetary government against the Circinus Federation. We've discovered that Circinus Federation has reactivated an old manufacturing facility in this system. To maintain the balance of power in the system, the planetary government needs to capture this facility. You'll make a surgical strike, occupy the base, and hold it until local government forces can arrive to take control. Hopefully, by doing this and moving against the Kinnis Federation, it might just throw the scent off that we're actually ones engaging in a bit of piracy. So we're going to we're going to negotiate. And we're going to take full salvage on this. We're doing okay for cash. Hopefully, we get a few things that we can sell. I believe I've got an uh, an XL engine that I can sell to uh, keep us flush if we need to. But we're going to head into combat. Um, we're going to swap out our pirate lance here real quick and bring in our main lance again so we've got our butcher our hunchback our blackjack and our trebuchet and we're just going to switch these two around and then we've got ground zero in the butcher we've got flatliner in the trebuchet we've got height in the what did we put him in before hunchback I believe so and Vein Skater in the Blackjack. Uh, no, it's the other way around. See, I keep forgetting that Height and Hunchback don't go together. Maybe we should put them in the same... Uh, actually, let's do this. This might help a little bit, too. Because usually I like moving the Hunchback first, so Vein Skater will be up here. Let's deploy and uh, see what we can do down here. Alright, here we go. So we got enemy contacts already. Four max on the ground. Got to capture the facility and hold it. So maybe two lances in total. Two and a half skull mission. So I'm hoping oh we encounter some heavies. What a hole. Yes, this is a hole. So 50 tonner and a 35 tonner. So it's probably going to be a couple of lances. Um, so let's just slowly move forward and uh, get this job done. Actually, we're going to reserve here first. See if their 35 tonner goes. No, they don't see us yet. Reserve right back to turn one. And then we can move height up. And we've had to rejig this guy since the last mission. We lost a bunch of flamers, so we've put a medium pulse laser and another flamer in to uh, make up for what we were missing. So let's move forward. I got you. Epsilon sensors. And we should be able to see what this guy is now, and he is a fire starter. Two vehicle flamers. So let's just put a pulse laser. Oh, the pulse laser won't hit from here. Put tag and arc might. All right, narked them. That's good. And they're not moving. All right. So let's move forward. We're gonna sprint. We want to get closer. I think. Let's move into here. Let's hope this Gauss rifle hits. I think after this battle we might refigure, reconfigure this. So we've got an 86% chance to hit. So let's just. Um, we're gonna leave the rocket launchers off. I think. But fire with everything else. Nice. Legged him. Alright, to maximize salvage on this guy, we're going to do... Um, but do we want this fire starter? That's my question. So this, does this guy have any quirks or anything? I don't think so. Just an H. So we're going to just... We're going to blow this guy up, I think. So let's get ground zero up here first. And we can spot him from here. With really good chances to hit. And we're just going to go for this. We're going to go for a headshot on him. Just see what happens. Left torso, right arm. That hit something good. It did. All right, so we're going to have to waste us. We waste some missiles on him this time. I don't think there's anywhere we can go that we can. Uh, oh, back here. But I want to keep moving forward. So maybe we get into here. Let's move. We lost a little bit of sight, but that's fine. Going to fire everything, going to go CT. Yeah, we're good. Primitive. So one laser hit. 
And here comes the missiles. And he's gone. Cool. Tango down. One less mech. Okay, so we are going to do... Um, Standing by. Can we get in to see these guys? We cannot. So we're just going to reserve here. See if they come to us. So 50, 250 ton mechs. Um, now do we have a chance to get in and spot them? We don't. Uh, so height. You got the speed? Let's get some eyes on. So coming around to... I don't know if I want to engage both these guys right away. Maybe we should. So let's do this. Move straight in. So looks like a trebuchet and a hunchback. What's the hunchback got on him? So he's the 4N. Not that dangerous. And this guy is the trebuchet. He's got more armor than the normal ones do. But we're going to fire on the hunchback. I'm on him. He's a little bit more threat right now than the trebuchet. Five flamers, his, it looks like. 70 heat, good. So that should keep him at bay for a turn. See, we go after him because he hadn't moved yet, right? Pretty much removes his turn. So That's let's good. get, since Vein Scanner's up front, let's move him around. Uh, we can get eyes on the hunchback, so let's try and take him out let's first. I think we're a little close for the uh, Goss Rifle, but we're going to fire it anyway. Okay, some good hits. A little bit of stability damage on him, that's not bad. Flatliner, can we get missiles on that guy? We certainly can. Mm, pretty good chance to hit too, so let's do that. Fast. I want to remove this hunchback as soon as possible, so I'm going to shoot everything but the small. Taking the shot. A little more stability damage on him, and I don't think I've got the speed to get in here on anybody. I don't, unfortunately. So we're going to move in, move over here a little bit, try and support height. Alright, so it's just these three guys, it looks like. So I've got the sprint, or i got the movement here, so we're going to move in... Um, I know I said I was going to support it. Yeah, we're going to do it this way. I was going to move on to this side and try and shoot through his other torso. But we're going to move up here, get the height on him, and we're going to unload both PPCs into his side. Now I could, what's his leg at here? Could try and take his leg off. What's our chances if we try that? 67%. Mm, let's just fire straight out. So we're just going to fire on him. It's a better chance this way. So we got one leg hit on him, arm hit. So he's going to have to move first, probably. Yep. He's going to melee too, little stinker. Okay, full miss. Okay, so he's still a little bit unstable. Uh, so we're going to get height next. And we're going to walk him around over to here. And shoot this trebuchet in the back. We're going to fire everything. Um, do I want trebuchet parts? We've got six of them, I think. So I'm going to leave off the pulse laser for now. And just go with the heat on this guy. Looks like five hits. Six hits. 85 heat. Nice. So I don't think he's doing anything now. Where are you going? Up the hill a little bit? Yeah, not bad. Okay, Van Skater, we're going to get you back over to here. Okay, good chances to hit with the Gauss Rifle. Let's back up over here. And we're just going to fire straight on this guy. Uh, rocket launchers, I want to hang on to it in case we have a second... Uh, we're going to hang on to them in case we have a second Lance that comes in their heavies. So that should be a knockdown. That one's going to leave a mark. It definitely will leave a mark. Okay, so Flatliner, Waiting let's get forward. you back up the hill a little bit. Yep, I 
think we're going to try and maximize salvage on this guy, but I think we're going to end up killing him. Yeah, he's only got 18 in the CT, so we're going to go for a headshot, leaving the lasers off. Yeah, there he goes. Not much we can do about that. That's a kill. That's a kill. Alright, ground zero. Um, I think we're going to try and maximize salvage on this guy. So we're going to walk it back here. And we're going to do an offensive push on his leg. And we've got some really good chances to hit here. Not enough to take his leg off, though. So, that was an offensive push, so we all go before him. He's got 13 left, so let's get height on the side of him here. We're going to do another offensive push. I love saving these until we want to um, take get a, get a mech that we really like. So I'm going to minimize the amount of flamers that we're going to use, because we're going to do some good damage on this guy. So let's just go, let's just go with three. Should get at least one leg hit, I think. Yeah, there we go. That hit good. So the follow-up is going to be Tihor. He's got the pinpoint damage. We're not going for a, we're not going for pilot on this one. Um, we're going to maximize by taking the leg. So we're going to move up here. We need to be at a little bit of a distance for this guy. On my way. So we're up here now. So let's just fire this guy straight. Going to shoot the leg, all the lasers. Nah, we spread that too much. I don't think the Goss hit the leg either. So what do we got left here? Hmm, 76. I don't think yep, Flatliner man. can finish him off with that. But let's just move over here. No, shooting. Just running. no, we want shooting too, buddy. All the lasers, leaving the LRMs off. I mean, I guess we could go with one LRM. Let's do that too. Let's go with one LRM. I'm going to go for the leg. Locked and loaded. Here he comes. The lasers just wouldn't be enough. Good work. And he bailed out. Nice. Okay, so we're going to move forward. Check out the base. Uh, actually, what we're going to do first... Okay. We're going to reserve... Gain our heat back, gain our stability back. Um, now let's all move together. Confirm. Gonna move height forward. Sacrificial lamb. Additional enemy forces rallying in the area. Question is, where in the area? Probably from down here. So let's set up. Waiting for orders. Let's get Van Skater. How far can you move? Oh. You're being blocked by a flatliner. Okay. So let's get... Is that the woods there? That is woods. Okay. Get up on the hill, get in the woods, so we can at least see over the trees here. Anyone comes, we're going to be able to attack them. Let's get Van Skater moving in the same direction. Uh, he won't be as far up the hill, but... That's fine. And we'll move fl uh, ground zero up the top of the hill as well. That should finish this turn off. We'll brace here. Hmm. I don't see any enemy units in the area. Let's reserve. Stand well, we're not going to stay there. So we're going to back up over here. Stay in the forest. Click done. Um, where are the enemy forces? Well, that's interesting. Hunkering down. Heads up, Commander. Oh, there they are. Alright, we'll let that move. Two mediums so far. There should be more coming from over here too, I thought, but maybe they're all coming down here. There's another one. That's a vehicle. What do we got? 50 ton vehicle? It's reserved. We'll let them go first. I'm just really hoping for some heavy max on this one. We may have to bump it up to three skull next time. 
So 55 and a, what's this guy? 255 time max. Maybe we'll get our Wolverine part finally. All right, so height. What are your orders, Skipper? You are the spotter, so let's get you in here. Uh, so it's either going to be the vehicle or the mech. Um, let's go with the vehicle. Aye, aye, Skipper. Full speed. Get right up on there. And I think what we'll do is we'll just fire. Let's turn all these on since they're out of range. Um, but let's fire the pulse. Full chrome, eh? Large laser, medium laser, triple plus, LRM. Fair bit of armor, so we're going to fire this stuff off. So three misses, not a big deal. There's another mech back here, too. Is that a heavy? Won't know yet, I don't think. No, we won't know. So, okay, let's go with pinpoint first. Bane skater, let's get up over here. Want to get a little bit of movement on these guys. Let's uh, fire everything except for the rocket launchers. Wow, that was impressive. Did we hit with a Goss though? I don't think it was the Goss that hit. Oh yeah, it was, looks like. Anyway, not bad. So let's put some missiles on them. Uh, it's too bad we can't actually make vehicles unstable. Rolling. But that's how it goes, I guess. All right. LRMs, lasers, firing everything. Target confirmed. Once again, wow. Bad chances to hit, but we're actually hitting. Nice. Okay, can I argue with that? Okay, we're gonna reserve. I don't think I think they've all moved. So we're gonna just fortify here. I get to go first anyway, but we're gonna reserve again. Confirmed. See what they do. Another fifty five tonner. Hoping for another Wolverine. So let's get height. Nah, let's wait. We're going to wait. I was going to move him against that, that guy back there, but he can get flanked easily by these two, so we're not going to go that route. So Shadowhawk. I know we've got a couple Shadowhawk parts. Ooh. Nice AC hit, buddy. My old mama can hit harder than that. So they've all gone now. So let's take height. We're going to walk you up over here. We're going to flank this guy. going to unload on him with everything. We're going to remove this guy fast. A lot of flamer hits. Even if we don't kill him, he's probably going to be running out of here next turn. So, Flatliner, let's start off with a bit of stability damage on him. We're going to move to an easier spot to hit. Let's move down here Moving for some direct hit. fire. Going to fire everything. Affirmative. Okay, so he's unstable now. So let's take Vein Skater. Not even going to move, we're just going to stand here. Going to fire. Going to go for the leg. Um, should we go after the leg? Hmm. Let's just fire. I don't want to waste this offensive push in case one of those guys is a Wolverine. We want to try and max parts, parts in the Wolverine. So let's just fire on this guy. Okay. See ya. Tango down. And ground zero's last. And I can't really get into a position where I can see the other guys, but I can move forward. Full speed. No target. And we'll be moving again next turn. Okay, so What's up, boss? let's get ourselves into a position where we can find out who these guys are. So we've got a Wolverine right here, 6R, and one of these Griffins, who can be very, very dangerous if we let roam around. So this guy's got 760, just a standard Wolverine. So we are going to do an offensive push on this guy. We're going to go for his leg, 61% chance to hit. We're going to fire. Okay, one hit. Got him with the tag, which is good. Let's see which one they go with. So the Griffin moving forward. That's going to give Height a chance to get around behind him. So Height's going to focus on keeping this guy tied up. So we're going to move back to here. Hmm, I don't know. 
here. 88. If I go here, it's the same, but I'm in the forest pretty much. So let's go over there. You got it. I'm gonna shoot this guy in the back. Firing everything. Firing. So that looks like we hit with pretty much everything there. 85 heat, so he's pretty much crowd controlled for now. I'm so you. flatliner, we don't I think we don't really need to move. Um, how much do we have left here? We've got plenty. So we're going to do an offensive push. We're going to fire on the Wolverine. We're going to try for headshot. And we're just going to fire... Yeah, let's fire everything. we got enough heat. We're not moving, so... Hoping for one headshot. Nope. I want to get him to bail out. That's my goal. Uh, but if we have to take both legs, we can do that too. Just going to back up, get up the hill a little bit. Doing the same thing. I'm going to fire at this guy. Uh, leaving the rocket launchers off, but we're just going to fire wildly. Hope when we connect. We hit with one, okay. That's fine. Here comes the Wolverine. Going for the melee attack. Fine by me. Okay, so we're going to walk it back. Actually, we're going to sprint it back to here. Where? I think I want to go this way. Going to go this way. And what we're going to do is we're going to target his other leg here. So we're going to do an offensive push. We're going to target this leg. Uh, I guess we have to leave one PPC off for this turn, but we are going to are going to go after it. Nope. Tag hits again. Okay. Fair enough. We really gotta max the parts out on this guy. So what's this guy doing? Whole lot of nothing. Okay, uh, so height. Let's get you around here. Roger, Skipper. Taking it. And we're gonna shoot on this guy's back. We're gonna leave the pulse laser off and fire with all the flamers. So we might be able to shut him down. Yep. So now we got a choice. Uh, I'm going to back Flatliner up a little bit to here, I think. Just going to walk back. And we're going to shoot at the Wolverine again. Um, we're going to leave off the small laser. And I think what we'll do is we're going to do... How much do we have left? we still got a fair bit. Let's do an offensive push here uh, on the Wolverine. We're going to shoot for the leg. We might get a headshot in there somewhere, but let's go after that leg. Firing. Okay, we've got a bunch of shots in the leg anyway. Good. And then Van Skater, we're not going to move. Um, we've still got a bunch left here. Resolves at 21%. Um, but I think what I want to do this time... ...is we're going to shoot on the Griffin because he has got... ...almost no damage. We're going to go after the leg. Actually, we could go for a headshot. Let's see if we can head him. We're going to fire the rocket launchers. Target fire it all. Okay, one head hit. Nice. My flamer is empty. Oh, that's fine. Let's see what the Wolverine's going to do. He's completely unstable. Okay, doing a little bit of damage. Not much, though. Okay, so yes, Commander. I'm going to walk back over here. Now, as much as I want to shoot that Wolverine in the back, because it's so tempting, I'm going to go after this Griffin. I know we got a bunch of these Griffin parts, too, so let's shoot after this guy. Let's try and get a headshot on him. I'm going to fire both PPCs in the tag. Confirm. Nope, I bet you that was two CT hits. So he's going to power up. And where is he at here? Yeah, those are but two CT hits. Pretty much. Okay, height. Going to stand still. Once again, going to fire on this guy's back with just the flamers. That should overheat him again. So free shots on him. Here comes the Wolverine. Looks like another melee attack. 
Damn you. You need me to hold seal for you? Receiving what are you talking you. about, dude? He hit you right hit you right in the I thing. Alright, let's fire this on this guy. Um uh, actually no. Let's go after actually mm, yeah, let's just fire on him. Maybe we might get that leg. Nope. And okay. flat now. And I got the question is is do we go after not bad. Let's split fire. On my way. So let's split fire. We're going to shoot the rockets on A, or the missiles on A, and we're going to fire the lasers on B. So let's hope for another head hit here. Nope, we're stressing them out though. Two laser misses. That's the miss. Oh, I don't really want to do this, but I'm going to have to because he's threatening my guys here. So we're going to shoot the Wolverine in the back. Two PPCs in the tag. Okay, we got his leg. going to knock him down, and he will be down to one health. Which knocks him back a turn. So Height has to move this turn. If he doesn't, he's going to be in trouble. So we're going to move to the flank. Uh, let's sprint it to the flank of this Griffin. Get a few chevrons of evasion in. Still going to be unstable, but that's fine. And we're going to fire, and maybe we Here get we that enough damage to take care of that leg. Ah, not really. 75 heat, not enough for a shutdown. Critical that's hit. fine. That is fine. So Vane Skater. We're going to pinpoint damage this leg, firing everything. Nope. Now that is something good. Oh, panic level critical, nice. So Flatliner, Daniel. we're going to multi-target again, except we're going to move first. So I want to be able to see both these guys, so let's do that. Going up the hill. And then we're going to multi-target. We're going to target the missiles on this guy and the lasers on B. And I think we're going to have to go with only one laser on B, I guess. So let's fire. Primitive. Ah, crap. Oh, well, we got the engine. He's gone. Come on, bail out, bail out, bail out, bail out. You know you want to. Apparently you don't. So we got to max the salvage on this guy. So it's either going to be a leg attack or some some other way to knock him down. Okay. Since flamers do very little in the way of shocking these guys, I am going to move here with the butcher. And we are going to put a PPC into his side. Now I hope... Jeez, I don't know if we torso him. How much has he got left in the leg? We could kill him if we hit his leg. We're either all in or we're all out. All in. Offensive push. Going after that leg. Let's fire and hope we get it. Yep. Nice. So, all we need is like one more Wolverine part, I think, and we've got a full Wolverine. Excellent, so that was a good mission. mission Except for a couple of auto cannon hits and that one or two punches, I think we did really, really well here. So, the salvage. So the salvage we want to get out of this, 120,000. Salvage we want to get is um, obviously the Wolverine. So hopefully we, we draw that. We've got no critical damage here. Let's find out what else we got in the, in the loot table. So lots of Griffin parts. We've got six of eight, so there's a good chance we get a Griffin. Um, Shadowhawk, nah, not so much. Trebuchet, we have different trebuchet parts. Wolverine, it's one of eight for this type of part, but we have other parts in there, so we've got a good chance of getting a Wolverine as well. So let's see what we get. 
let's put this. I'm going to put this uh, flamer in because we can really use that back on the uh, uh, blackjack again. Haywire EMP we don't have, so that's a possibility. Large laser? No, we don't need the large laser. Medium laser, triple plus. Accuracy, evasion, and ore and crit. We don't really want the extra crit though. I want to get as many components as possible. So cockpit DNI, that's pretty good. Um, it's worth 830,000. Guardian ECM, one of the things we're low on. We don't have any of those. So let's take one of those. Take the big fusion core and gyro XL for now. See what else we got down here. No exchangers, unfortunately. Uh, patchwork materials is a possibility. Tier 2 for half a ton. Uh, it's only half a ton, though. I'm thinking that this is probably good the way we have it. There really isn't anything that's stellar. Um, cockpit DNI, minus 10% damage taken is not bad, but we're not really doing melee and death from above, so it's really... 10% isn't that much, really. I mean, it is if we're in long, dragged-out fights, but... Okay, we're going to go this route and see what kind of mech parts we get here. Okay, one, two, three trebuchet parts. One, two, three, four Wolverine parts. We've got a Wolverine now. That's awesome. So I have to figure out which mech. We might even have a trebuchet, too. To figure out which mech we're going to uh, replace. Plasma Lance. Anything else interesting? Our melee damage. Talons. Okay, not bad. Alright, there's the Wolverine. 6M. Not sure what the 6M gets us, though. Uh, with the addition of lasers removed... Re with the addition of lasers removes its reliance on ammunition. 6M tends to run a bit hot, especially if you're using jump jets. Which we generally don't. Oh, so we didn't get a trebuchet, but that's fine. 13,000. So we made about 110,000, 105,000, somewhere around there. So let's have a look at that Wolverine now. Let's go to the mech, mech bay real quick. Before we end this episode. And we're going to get the Wolverine. Here we go. Let's refit this guy. Looks like we got the gyro. Or does is there an engine in there? That's the question. It said engine gyro, but I don't know if there is an actual engine in this guy. No, everything got got pretty much trash. Let's repair this guy. So what do we got for hard points? We got two laser, uh, three lasers, two missile. Hmm. Interesting. It's a potential for a half decent mech. I'm not really 100% sure if I like this layout, loadout, though. Three lasers and two missile hard points isn't a whole lot. Well, let's take let's just repair this for now. We're gonna confirm this. It's only ninety thousand. We made that in this mission, so that's okay. Let's confirm it. We'll get it repairing. Right. I'll get it in the Let's have a brief look at this Vindicator. I don't think there's anything wrong with the Vindicator. I think it is only um Yeah, we lost the arm hand on it. Just going to repair it, just quickly uh, replace that real quick before we have to do another pirate mission. Um, we'll confirm that. So we're going to end the episode here. Uh, hope you liked the episode. If you did, please feel free to subscribe. And stay tuned, uh, at least look at the, uh, the second uh, channel I've got running, or the second playlist I've got running with the Pirate Lance, which we're going to run next. Um, they're going to take on uh, a mission on the planet as well. So, uh, yeah, feel free to check that out, and we'll see you next time.